Some of you have been asking me about the chunk strum or the muted strum, and that's a common sound uh, that you'll hear a lot of guitar players, a lot of ukulele players, basically string instrument players uh, make. And here's an example. I'll use the reggae strum to illustrate this one. So what's that sound? It's Now in some cases, it could be as simple as just tapping the neck. You'll see a lot of guitar players kind of do that um, as a percussive element. Uh, you can literally just mute the strings. But there's also a subtle thing that can happen, and that is the finger, the index finger in this case, hitting the strings about at the same moment, right? Just before you do the mute. It's really almost simultaneous, so it's kind of like brushing the index finger while you're muting. So instead of doing this sound with two hands, you're kind of doing the same thing with one. It's actually something that I don't really think about because I think it'll come naturally to most people when you put in those ukulele hours or guitar hours. When you play a lot, uh, you're going to find that you'll naturally kind of develop and evolve your playing. And this is one of those things that just doing different strums. You know, up strums, down strums chunk strums, it'll just sort of evolve. But if you wanted to break it down, that's how I would do it. So I would say, again, brush the strings lightly with your index finger on the way down, and then you're just gonna basically place your palm onto the strings. All right, I hope this is helpful. I'm Kalani, thanks for watching.